The Checkpoint is presented by GM Pharma, the first international multinational pharmaceutical company in Georgia. GM Pharma, to serve those who need it most. Let us now look at what were some of the main economic trends of the week. Fitch ratings affirmed Georgia's long-term uh, foreign currency issuer default rating at BB with a stable outlook. According to Fitch, the Russian invasion of Ukraine has so far been a large positive economic shock as up to 90,000 Russian, Belarusian and Ukrainian nationals have entered Georgia. This has resulted in remittances surging 65% year-on-year in first half of 2022, with remittances from Russia alone more than tripling. Fitch currently views this as a one-off exogenous shock and the lasting impact on the balance of payments and external finances is not yet fully clear. What Fitch calls a large positive economic shock, Transparency International Georgia calls Georgia's economic dependence on Russia. According to TI Georgia, such dependence poses a threat to the country. In particular, the data as of June 2022 on trade between Georgia and Russia, tourist remittances, foreign direct investments from Russia and registration of Russian companies in Georgia were analyzed by TI Georgia. In January, June 2022, Georgia received about uh, 1.2 billion USD in income from Russia through remittances, tourism and commodity exports, which is two and a half times more than the income received from Russia in January, June 2021 from the same sources. Moreover, this year's receipts are 36 percent more than the income received from Russia before COVID-19 in January, June 2019. This means that compared to previous years, Georgia's economic dependence on Russia has been increased. This growth is mainly due to the soaring remittances. Exports of goods taken separately decreased, the report reads. The Checkpoint is presented by GM Pharma, the first international multinational pharmaceutical company in Georgia. GM Pharma, to serve those who need it most.